chocolate. chocolate. Godiva. Godiva. I just remembered it was Godiva. Godiva! Go you! Godiva, isn't it? Godiva? Yeah. Damn it. I always thought it was called Godiva, not Godiva. I didn't know it was called anything because this is the first I've ever heard of this stuff. <laughs> oh. oh! A masterpiece. Like, like, artwork. I think Ooh. you've oversold it to me already. Yeah, we tried Godiva chocolate before, but apparently these ones are the masterpieces. These are the good the ones? The best of the best! Yes! So let's see if they really are masterpieces. Ah, my favourite flavour. Plain. Oh, yes! Look at this. Milk chocolate bliss. 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 Oh. That's promising a lot now. Looks like a thin bar of gold. Very, very. Like, oh yeah, it's <laughs> gold in them heels. <laughs> oh, little, uh, looks like Legos. That's impressive. Build your own masterpiece with this. Who, oh, you are truly a masterpiece. It is a creamy milk chocolate filling. Mm. Very, um, it melts in your mouth. Mm. Mm. I'm not overwhelmed. I'm not underwhelmed. I am whelmed. It's like a, a, a chocolate baptism. Yeah. You just let the water wash over you. It doesn't remind me of being naked on a horse, but it's nice. It's not bliss. Because bliss is like, this is more like, yeah, this is like grand. No one can hurt me anymore. None of that pain I feel from when I first wake up till I go to sleep. Because I've had this chocolate. But I have to return to the real world now. Ah! Ah! Pump up now. Oh, nice almost catch. We got a salted caramel up in here. Consistently in these videos. Yes. When a salted caramel is happening, you're at least getting a bit of flavor. It's a, it's a well put together chocolate. Mm -hmm. Smooth, sophisticated little chocolate with buttery, caramelized toffee pieces and a touch of sea salt. We enjoy the sea salt. We do. We do. We often go down to the beach together and we just have a, we just have a little bit of a taste yeah. test. Yeah. Fresh from the ocean. Mm. Crunch right in there. Crunch straight away. Crunch straight away. We're in masterpiece territory. Salted caramel, good. We Chocolate's good. We tried a lot of chocolate in our, in our lives. Yes. This is a pretty great flavor. This is definitely up there. I, I would say this is a masterpiece. I absolutely would. I get it now, you see. It's not necessary that it tastes better, but the stigma of it costing more and being called masterpiece, you feel like you just take it and you go, ah, oh, yes. This is masterpiece chocolate. Would you buy this chocolate? I don't know if I would. Mm. I like that one better. Oh, it's another league, you know? They didn't have to mess around with creating an air pocket. Yep. Uh, we're gonna let the chocolate speak for itself. Salted caramel. Mm -hmm. Done perfect. What can you do? Did you throw it in? Did you? Did you throw it? Oh. This one. This one tried to get away from us. This I one have is. had this one before. It is good. What a flavor are we getting today? Milk chocolate caramel lion of Belgium. Is that a flag? Caramel, caramel lion. lion. Oh, it's got a little lion on it. Ooh. We just had. Caramel, caramel with it was like hard caramel toffee pieces and sea salt, and this is caramel. I think it's like gooey caramel, a not, goo. not, not not hard. Oh, I love a goo. A goo. I love a bit of goo. Well, give me the goo. Give me the goo. Goo in my mouth. It's gooey. It's sticky. It's a good goo. It is good goo. Let's be fair. It's good goo. Oh, there's a, there's a nice flavor that's happening. It's pretty good. This is a milk chocolate caramel. The last one was salted caramel. I do prefer the salted. Yeah. It's really hard to do these kind of shoots because you're just eating chocolate and you're like. Yeah, because you're like, yeah. oh my god, it's chocolate. That was nice. But you can't really tell it's a lion. I'll be honest. Yeah, I don't know what they're doing with adding the, adding the lion. Looks like one of the Bee Gees. They're calling it a masterpiece, okay? That might be a little bit overselling it. I would agree. Like, Godiva, you're doing okay. You're doing grand. Masterpiece, that's like for Schubert and Michelangelo. Uh, yeah. It's definitely a masterpiece. I just don't know if I appreciate it for what it is. That's true. Maybe it's before my time, you know? That's, yeah, that's it. We're gonna sue you! You don't do that to my boy Colin! Who do you think you are? Milk chocolate hazelnut oyster? Ooh. That is up my street. Delicate milk chocolate oyster shell filled with creamy hazelnut praline filling made to savor every day. Oh! So, yeah, now we're, this is now we're talking. Now we're getting into the luxury. Look at this. You're willing to throw a few extra bit of that. How many comes in a packet? Uh. This uh, many? Not a lot. Like, not a lot. It's what, maybe like 15 or something? Oh, no, Praline is my fave chocolate. Praline? 
Okay, oh. famous oyster. Oh. The shell logo. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the world's our oyster. Ah, true. No. Oh, it's very soft though. I have to say, I've eaten real oysters. And this is much better than a real oyster. <laughs> oh, it's not one giant hazelnut in the middle, it's like little bits. That's the best so far. That's fantastic. Mm. It's kind of like if you melted a Ferro Rocher. Mm. Yes. And you're like, I don't like chewing. Yeah, yeah I just want to, oh, I want my chocolate to be fed to me like a baby bird. Like a baby yeah, bird. Yeah. yeah, chew it up and spit it in my mouth. <laughs> That's a bit of a masterpiece now. Yeah, my sugar spike went very fast in the second one, and then I'm back down here again. <laughs> if, I was, if I was left alone with that bag, that bag would be empty. You'd be making love to that bag. I'd be, I'd be, <laughs> I'd be eating the chocolate. I, I would not be making love to that bag. Nice catch. Smooth. All right, no need to show both. We have dark chocolate ganache heart. Something very sophisticated about that dark chocolate anyway. I'm curious to see if it's soft inside like the last one though. Ganache is the real like shimmery chocolate. Definitely not meant to be a, a heart. No. Mine's, yeah, mine's got like South America like tapped on the front yeah. of it. This is actually shaped more like a human heart than a cartoon heart. I mean, if this is mine though, I definitely would want to transplant. I need to start jogging. <laughs> Soft again, but something different to it. Yeah, they're delicious. Mm. Wow. Oh no, you see, I prefer this to the last one. Very, very, very thick chocolate, mm. isn't it? It's the kind that you're like, it's in your saliva for a good four hours post munch. Eating so much chocolate, you realize that the kind of like the, the darker the chocolate gets, the, the less kind of fun it is to eat. Yeah. It's better for you. Apparently. Apparently, but it's less fun. Mm. There's um, something very significant about dark chocolate and like class and fancy chocolates are always dark chocolate, aren't they? Yeah. No, you never had a fancy party and someone goes, let's get the Milky Bars out. <laughs> exactly, that's it. It's nice fancy chocolate though, isn't it? Like if you're looking for a luxurious chocolate, that's a good option for you. Over Oversold, right? Masterpiece. Look, 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 don't, don't go in with a high bar in life. Don't try and achieve because you'll just be disappointed. They were all masterpieces, but not all masterpieces are enjoyable. Well guys, thanks very much for watching today's video. If you want to see more videos, make sure you like and subscribe and click the bell for notifications so you can, God, Jesus, don't forget to leave a comment if you enjoyed it. <laughs>